The Moto G8 Plus certainly doesn't look like a mid-range device. Sporting a stunning 6.3-inch Max Vision Full HD Plus IPS display for bright colours and clarity. Indeed, this boasts a pixel resolution of 2280 by 1080 at roughly 400 pixels per inch, and edge-to-edge -edge technology makes media playback a real pleasure. Now, the dew drop notch hasn't hindered video playback all that much, which is good news since there is no software tech in this phone to hide it, as an 82.5% screen-to-body ratio and a tall 19 to 9 aspect ratio allows for a really immersive experience. A contrast ratio of 16-12 to 1 isn't all that bad for a device at this price point. However, an LCD panel will never be able to compete with the true blacks that can be produced by an OLED display. The screen itself is topped by a layer of panda glass to protect it from bumps and bruises, whilst the device itself has a thin nano coating layer that Motorola describes as water repellent, but not actually waterproof. The device also comes with a TPU case in box. Indeed, the G8 Plus is actually a plastic build rather than the more premium glass. This does make it fairly prone to smudges and dirt, but on the plus side, it's less likely to shatter and is certainly more lightweight. At 188 grams and with dimensions of 158.35 times 75.83 times 9.09 millimeters, it is a lot more pocket friendly than many other similar devices. I'm a big, big fan of the gradient finish on the back, and the Motorola logo actually doubles up as a fingerprint scanner. The rear of the device is also home to a triple lens camera system consisting of a 48 megapixel main sensor with an f1.7 aperture and PDAF tech, a 5 megapixel depth sensor with an f2.2 aperture, and lastly a 16 megapixel ultra wide action camera with an f2.2 aperture and a 117 degree field of view. Images shot with ample lighting are brilliant with plenty of detail and decent colour reproduction. Onboard AI enhancements also work very well to ensure the best possible picture every time, and they don't oversaturate as much as other similar devices that I've used. That said, the dynamic range could be better, even with HDR turned on. Quad pixel tech is also respectable and works by combining four pixels into a single large one for improved light sensitivity that gives for more detailed pictures with improved colour and clarity. The resulting pictures are, of course, 12 megapixels. Motorola's camera software isn't half bad, and high res zoom allows for digital zoom up to eight times, getting you closer to your subject. But as you can see, the details are certainly, certainly lost. The G8 Plus is able to record 4K video at 30 frames per second, a full HD at 120 frames per second, and comes with electronic video stabilization to keep your moving images smooth and focused. The 16 megapixel action camera can shoot horizontal video even when held in a portrait orientation. However, the maximum resolution with this lens is 1080p. Now, if selfies are more your thing, then the G8 Plus has a single 25 megapixel front shooter with an f2.0 aperture. This comes with similar quad pixel tech for 6 megapixel results and takes some really impressive selfies for the price point. Now, the Moto G8 Plus runs the efficient Qualcomm Snapdragon 665 processor with 4GB of RAM, making simple day-to-day -day tasks fast and smooth. Android 9 Pie ships in box with a promise of an update to Android 10 soon and is lightly dusted with Moto experiences such as gestures. This allows you to do things like activate your torch with a double karate chop or launch the camera with two swift twists. Onto the battery, then the 4000 milliamp is fantastic for this kind of device and should keep you going for one to two days without a problem. When it is time to recharge, the device actually comes with an 18 watt turbo power charger in box and takes just over two hours to charge from 0 to 100%. The device has 64 gigabytes of internal storage for all of those apps and pictures. However, it also supports a micro SD card of up to 512 gigabyte within the hybrid SIM slot. Finishing things off, the G8 Plus has a 3.5mm headphone jack on top, a USB-C port and support for NFC. So Motorola's G range has long been at the forefront when it comes to great mid-range devices, and with the G8 Plus it certainly continues that trend. With a near-pure Android experience, a fantastic battery life and a triple lens camera headed up by a 48 megapixel lens, the G8 Plus gets all of the essentials very, very right, and some. For only $239.99 Inkvat from Clove Technology, you won't find many better all-round experiences than the Moto G8 Plus, so go and check that one out. 
Now, make sure you subscribe to our channel for all of the latest news and reviews, and I'll catch you again soon.